Yo, what's up, guys? Axelite Foxy, Foxy Ninja here. We are back in the reveal. And welcome, finally, to Five Nights at Eats. Now, before I start playing this, the creator asked whoever records Let's Play of this to record what this says. So, I better read it. This is a fan game. Everything you see in this game does not belong to the creator. Five Nights at Freddy's and all of its content belong to Scott Cawthon, like Freddy and the gang. Five Nights at Candy's and all of its content belong to Emil Ace Mako. So, like... Candy, which is, or more or less all that, that's content from a mill, whatever. Okay, this game was made in dedication to Eth Goes Boom. Eth Goes Boom is a YouTuber. He gave me permission to make this game. Eth Goes Boom is also Scott Cawthon approved. Everything else belongs to the rightful owners. The creator owns nothing. I kind of, well, maybe like the original ideas in the game. Like the very, very original ideas. But anyways, cause like you gotta credit yourself so much, cause like I think you, I think you own some stuff. Well, but either way, yeah, I'm a huge ETH goes boom fan, like I've said. And okay, let's read the rest. All applicable items are mentioned clearly in the credits of this game, which can be accessed at the main menu or when an ending is achieved. If there are any problems regarding this content, please do not blame ETH. Please contact me, the creator of this game, at Indigo. Gamer000 at gmail.com, and I will try to resolve the problem as best as I can. Well, yeah. And also, I am so surprised when Indigo Gamer actually commented on my uh, analysis video of his game jewel page for this game, and he actually said it was really good. So, I'm happy to do this. Hopefully, we'll get some fun out of this, and we'll play this. So, let's see what we do. Warning this game contains flashing lights, loud noises, sudden movements. And, and a lot of jump scares. This game also contains mild con cartoon violence, etc, etc. Oh no, they did it! Oh. Wait, what? Scrapped. Hmm, night watch, eh? <laughs> Alright, let's go. Okay. Local supply and production industry is in supply emporium. E S E. Oh, that's what E S E stands for. Is looking for a night watch for the week to make sure everything stands, stays secure, and make sure the robots don't make bad decisions. Call one I am a C U P C A. K.E. for more information, I'm a cupcake. Yes, he's not responsible for it. The robots will be scrapped for parts in six days. So I'll try and get the bad at being involved. Actually, no, I'll try and get the Night good. one! Night one! Oh, I'm gonna love this game because I'm a huge fan of everything ETH does. I want to do Final Fantasy ETH's world as well. Oh no, it's not responding. No! Come on, game. Oh. Why had to come in an hour early? Hey, you there! Listen up! Thanks for coming in early! I <laughs> need to candy? talk to you! You know who you are! You know who I am! Remember me, buddy? I'm a secret project that you made a voice box for during your free time! Candy the Cat! <laughs> I'm communicating through this old walkie-talkie! I heard what happened to our friends, and I am here to help! I cannot be long, as I must remain hidden! Do not let them find me. 
You're the yeah. only one who can save them all now. Thank you. They are under a spell. Thanks, Candy. A curse, oh, if you must. You must find a way to free them. They will only come after you, as they know who you are. They will catch me if I speak for much longer. I will not speak during the shift. But before I go, it is important that you look through the files to your left behind you. I'm right. sure the boss keeps secrets and records in there that will help you find the solution. The animatronics follow a pattern, yeah. as they are still bound by their old mechanics. At 6 a.m., they won't attack anymore, and you are safe to roam. I will help you then, so until then, survive. <laughs> oh, great. When an animatronic appears at your desk, so let's turn the light off. It's easy to turn it on. Click on things. Ooh, a cupcake! A golden one, huh? <laughs> I probably shouldn't eat it. It belongs to the boss, after all. Okay. Click on things. This is the only way you can keep them from finding. Let's see what these files hold for us. Wait, what does it say? So, you've returned, huh, bad man? What's that? Uh, I don't understand any of this. I better see what's going on. I can watch them on the camera, but I know if they get in my room, I have to turn off the light. I mean, turn off the light. No. Okay, good. I'm good. I'm doing good right now. Man, this game's really good. Oh, there's JJ. <laughs> is that BB? Oh, BB is right next to my office. Oh, these are all the toy animatronics. I can see toy body, toy body, toy body. BB might be the first to try and attack me though. Does he have his own jump scare? First fan game with a BB jump scare. Nice. I better sing them. And they're singing them off. If you think I'm cute or harmless, I'll rip your vocal cords out! Oh, he's gone. That's nice. I'll get the files some more. What's this? Ethan. See, I can't understand any of this because it's too big. Oh, turn page. A oh, arrow keys to turn page. These crumpets are as <laughs> I hear a toy, Freddy. Ooh, Please, crumpets something. Oh, that's funny. Where's he? Oh, BB and JJ are both back. Toy Freddy's now gone. Oh, Toy Freddy's right there. He's like, shaking his fist at me. You dang kids, you off my property. Okay, I need to look at it. Okay, so this is five minutes. How to start, how to spot a demon. Some demons have the ability. Great, so this is Five Nights at Sonics. Okay. What's up, fire cake? <laughs> he's not like, I'm a fire <laughs> Oh no, this is my I like that camera sound. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, he's over there. He's like, hey. He's hanging out with Spring Bunny. Ready. Okay. Oh, I've heard Toy Patty. Those are we! We are the Paper Pals! And we get to tell you that we do nothing at all! I the Paper Pals talk. <laughs> and then Toy Ray just bumped in my room. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was hilarious. I just heard Toy Fred just bump in my Who are we? We are the Paper Pals! And we're coming to tell you that we think you're going. Kill, burn, wreck, ruin, smash, other words! What? Oh, is that candy? I think I heard candy. Well, where's Freddy, Bonnie, and Chica? Foxy. It must be in here. And Mango. Where the heck is Mango? It's Toy Bonnie. Foa, Foa, Foa. Uh, stop in this game. I'm wearing a cool star shirt. So I should be wearing my horror game bandana, but I don't think I feel like doing that. This doesn't match my outfit. Okay, what does it say? Reality distorts when, when you've, what? When you're scared. Reality distorts when you're scared. Okay, that makes sense. It's saying different shifts for each thing. Okay, guys, you might need to take a screenshot of this. So, because it's, it's probably important. Alright, where's Toy Bonnie? Toy Bonnie, where did you go? I'm gonna pound your head so hard, you'll wish for a hangover headache! Fala, Fala, Fala. <laughs> the Fala's again. See, this is easy. I could just keep this thing on off all night. Hmm. I bet 
that there's like a mechanic where I... Yeah, there's probably some mechanic in the light of night where I have to like actually just keep the light on. Like, it would make sense for Foxy. Now, th that would make logical sense if Foxy was like that. <laughs> Toy Chica. I see you. Some demons have the ability to manifest, this, uh, manifest themselves into a physical being. This brings up the topic of possession. Stronger demons have the ability to possess certain objects and living organisms. A demon has possessed something, its qualities will change. If it is a living or if it is living organism, its mindset will also change. The man L M G L O L. Look at you! You're going to hell. <laughs> That's a really good cheer, to be honest. I will find a way to save you guys. Hold on. Okay. Let's go back to the paper. With the main types of demons, there are a certain spawn of demons that come from a different dimension. Only the strongest of those other dimensional demons have the ability to manifest and possess. Now, I'll listen to this later, guys, so I can actually figure the code and stuff. Those demons commonly attack young children and small animals. They are actually quite common, especially during the small hours of the morning. If you think someone is possessed by these or otherworldly demons, here's a list of signs to look for. Okay, I'll look at that again. Even though I bet it's like some like fan article or something like that. Oh, BB's gone. <laughs> BB's over there. Give me the. Give me the. Uh, one of the. Just a weird eye. Whatever. Mm. He went, he moved. Okay, you're right there, baby. Okay. Come on, pop a ball. Pop a ball. Come on. Then you'll wish you could breathe again! Whatever, baby. Is that a game console? Oh. Don't tell me the boss plays video games during his shifts. <laughs> I wonder what game it has in it. Probably Zelda. Oh yeah, it mentioned something about Zelda in the credits, so... I'll make logical sense. Okay, let's go back to bring this. They will calmly share as nightmares to work their way into the physical world. Nightmares become too overwhelming, they will escape into the living world. A person who has such nightmares will begin to behave differently. Some symptoms include unresponsiveness, singing in an unknown language, dark messages and writings, and voice alterations. True. They yeah, have possessed something, their eyes will become completely black in, in some extreme cases. They will also emit a barely visible strange aura that is magnified which viewed on electronic screens such as cell phone, photos, security, video cameras, and television screens. I am not a violent animatronic, have also been but recorded. you are the exception. Prepare to perish! <laughs> Toy Fred. Go back to eating your dang crumpets, Toy Fred. <gasps> oh no, where is he? Did he move that? He's already there? <laughs> well, their eyes are completely black, so I don't know. Um, why are they cursed? There's another thing out. I'm a cupcake. I'm a cupcake. Cupcake. <laughs> I swear. So it's gonna be Wait! Don't move yet! I did research. You need to collect the cupcakes from the cupcake crew. Oh, they are does. hidden throughout the facility. I will track them down as best I can and find their location for you. 
for now, the only one you can get is really close by. And I don't know what is so special about them, but, uh, we'll find out, I guess. Okay, hurry now. You're on a time limit before the morning crew shows up. Um, how much time do I have? Oh, it's a cupcake. Please yeah. come back tomorrow. We yes. need you. I got it. Night two. Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then please spam that thumbs up with the thumbs up and subscribe to me for more awesome daily content. Now, see you guys later. Bye, all.